Hey guys, good morning. It's afternoon, I always do that. It's 2.30. It's Thursday, March 3rd, and I am in the process of letting my hair air dry. This is what it looks like when I've kind of tried to pull Let's try that again. So I've tried to kind of pull some of my curls so that it wasn't super, super curly, but it's still really curly. And unfortunately, still a tad bit damp. So um, I'm going to go ahead and blow dry, which I hate doing because I plan on straightening it. So it's going to be like heat after heat. But what are you going to do? I use the Sidhu Revolution 4000i. It's pretty old and like heavy, but at the time it was a great like good expensive hair dryer. I'm still trying to catch my breath from the stairs. I wanna get this done. Stephanie's coming over to drop off her taxes and then um, I wanna put on a little bit of makeup just to like mainly, I've got two huge cystic acnes, one right here and one right here. Where they came from I have no freaking clue but I wanna kinda of cover them up a little bit and just feel, I don't know, pretty for today. So <laughs> I'm just gonna make sure the rest of my hair is dry so I can start straightening it and go about my day. So this is what I look like as a big fuzzball. And I think some of it's still maybe a little damp. I'm going to go through and kind of comb it out and check it out so I can start straightening it because I cannot go out looking like this. So I will see you after I am done straightening this crazy mange. So unfortunately, I did not get to put on any makeup. So I'm still barefaced, but I did get to straighten my hair. So, you know, for about three days, it'll look good. It'll look decent. We are headed to Outback Steakhouse to have dinner for my stepdad's birthday and I got him some balloons. Older than dirt and over the hill because he's the big 4-0. I know, kind of weird. My mom definitely married young <laughs> considering Andres is just a year older or a year younger than him. Um, yeah, but him and my mom have been together for years and years and years and uh, he pretty much grew up with our family which is crazy but he did so yeah he's turning 40 we got him an oreo cake i wish it'd been ice cream but this is all he had and then we got him um a card and a gift card because that's him like he's just a hard person to buy for so um we're on our way i haven't been to outback steakhouse in years and years and years my best friend tara um loves Outback and we used to go there for her birthday every year. I haven't been since so yeah we have the girls with us. <laughs> and it's funny because my nephew now goes to the same preschool that Maddie goes to that Emmy went to and um, so we pulled up and my brother and sister-in-law were picking up Anderson when we were there so that, I thought that was cute. So anyway we are headed to dinner and I can't wait to eat. Yeah, okay. Okay. Hey Anderson, you like seeing cousin all day at school? He's like a Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Tony. Happy birthday to you. Oh, I is that yummy? <laughs> Let's see if they'll do it again. Maddie, give cousin kiss. Give cousin kiss. <laughs> Anderson. Anderson. Anderson, give cousin kiss. No. <laughs> See, because she gets like out on top of the pillow. 
Sweet like on the board. Oh. <laughs> Say good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Hey guys, here we go with the bad angle again. I don't even care. Like, I watch my videos back sometimes and I'm like, holy crap, what were you even thinking? But honestly, I just don't even care. Mm, I'm to that point where, what ifs? So I just got done editing today's vlog and it's a long one actually, almost 19 minutes, which I'm pretty shocked because several, I don't know, the last two or three weeks worth of vlogs have been like 10. 11 minutes I even think I had like a six minute one so I definitely 19 minutes is pretty pretty up there but it's because I ramble so much like the story I was telling talking at the end of yesterday's vlog about Emmy and about her behavior and being bored at school and just like different things and it was freaking nine minutes nine minutes and when I was watching it back like everything I was saying was pertinent to the conversation that I was having with myself and you guys and so I couldn't really cut much of it out but when I'm talking to the camera I don't feel like I'm talking that long it's so weird that's why my beauty videos are super long too because I elaborate on everything and I don't know why <laughs> like when I'm doing it I don't feel like I've been talking very long but I will have shown half of the things that I haven't already be at 20 minutes where I wasn't even yawning before I turned the camera on it's crazy so I don't know what the heck's wrong with me like I really don't like today I think the vlog's like maybe six minutes and then me talking will make it 10 or 11 I don't know how I cannot get enough vlog footage throughout the day but yet I can sit here and talk for 10 minutes at a time and it doesn't even phase me I don't get it anywho tomorrow is Emmy's field trip so I'm calling it an early night it's 9 30 I wanted to get the vlog up because I knew it was a lot of footage so I just wanted to get it done and exported so that I could start um, uploading it while I go to sleep I need to be I need to get up early in the morning because my hair straightened so yay <laughs> yay me I won't have to do anything besides brush my teeth and wash my face when I wake up in the morning and um throw on some clothes so that'll be cool oh my goodness and um, I need to pack a lunch so I I don't know I feel like I remember when I was in elementary school either the school providing us lunch or like we went out to eat on our field trip I don't I guess not they're going to Fiesta Farms which I guess is like a farm and the teacher specifically said like they don't need any money there's no food there so pretty much like they can't buy a souvenir or anything so I don't <laughs> it's kind of weird like I don't remember I remember needing money and I'm pretty sure we ate at like McDonald's or something on the way home I I really have no idea so I have to pack our lunch and since I am chaperoning the field trip I need to pack myself a lunch as well I'm not sure how much footage I'm going to get just because there's going to be a lot of minor children there and uh, mine is the only one that I plan on recording so I don't know how that's going to go over but I do know in the morning I need to I'm probably just going to do something non-perishable like peanut butter and jelly with a bunch of things like I'll put a cold pack in there but she has to be able to throw everything away actually so now I don't think I can put a cold pack I'm gonna have to figure it out tomorrow but anyway she's really excited like when she went to bed she we had to tell her several times over the monitor to go go to bed lay down it's time for bed like she was having like butterflies I think over going so I'm happy that she's super excited you see four minutes four minutes in already and I'm like what did I even talk about and I don't even know why I'm so tired either because yesterday I slept until 2 and then I was in bed by 11 and I slept the whole night I woke up at 7 o'clock this morning because I heard the girls getting ready I helped them finish up and then I came back to lay in bed and right around 7:30. Oh no, I guess they they had left or so it was like 7:45. I was like I'm not going to doze off. Like I want to stay awake. I could get a ton of stuff done. And what did I do? I dozed back off and then it was like 8:30 or 8:45 and I woke up and I was like, "Okay, no, this is going to be the time that I get up." And then I dozed back off until 9:30 and I was like, "No, no, okay, this for real. I'm starving. Like this is going to be the time for me to get up." 
And then I wake up again and it's 10 o'clock and Andres comes in the room and he's like, oh, I'm sorry, did I wake you? I need to get ready for work. I was like, what is wrong with me? I cannot pull myself out of bed. I was up at seven. I could have been so productive in those three hours. Instead, I just slept them away. And I slept so much the day before, but that is what night shift does to me every single week. It makes me exhausted. And so today I feel like because I woke up early, but I kind of took naps in between, kind of like my body still feels like I woke up early because those naps weren't really anything like they weren't true sleep or anything so I have no idea I have no idea why I'm just so exhausted <laughs> I have such a hard life apparently anyway I think I've rambled on enough I'm telling you this is I could just talk all freaking day I don't know what's wrong with me I need an intervention intervention so anyway I hope that you guys enjoyed today's vlog footage even though it was a short one um, hopefully tomorrow's a little bit longer. I have some stuff to do after I drop off Emmy at school and or see her back to the school and stuff like that. So hopefully it's a decent sized vlog, but I hope you enjoyed today nonetheless, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye!